Harley Davidson is in the process of reinventing itself. The resurgence kickstarted with the Pan America 12 52 years ago, and now comes another brand new motorcycle which is of more relevance. The Sportster S. Harley Davidson is in the process of reinventing itself. The resurgence kickstarted with the Pan America 12 52 years ago. And now comes another brand new motorcycle which is of more relevance. The Sportster S. While the Harley Sportster nameplate has been around for over six decades, the American firm says the Sportster S marks an all-new direction for the manufacturer with its style, performance and technology. Now, People can have differing opinions on its performance and technology, we will discuss these in detail in a bit but you can't possibly say the same about its design. Irrespective of your taste, the Sportster S looks bad to the bone like a proper American hot rod. The motorcycle weighs 228 kilograms, which makes it quite heavy. However, the seat height is 765 millimeters, meaning it's quite accessible for riders of all heights. The riding posture is cruiser-like, as you sit with your legs fully stretched out. However, the flat rack style bars will make you sit in a slightly crouched position, putting more weight on the front which is quite comfortable for short riders. Sportster S gets a new 4-inch round TFT display, which packs a raft of features and information. Features like cruise control, traction control, cornering abs, and full LED headlamps are standard. The Hurley-Davidson Sportster S is powered by 1,252 cubic centimeters BS6 engine which develops a power of 120.69 brake horsepower and a torque of 125 newton meters. With both front and rear disc brakes, Hurley-Davidson Sportster S comes up with anti-locking braking system. I expected the Sportster S to be a step up from the previous model, but this is in a different dimension. If you ask me, it's easily the best Harley-Davidson I have ever ridden.